Hello, Tastefully Simple. I'm so excited to share with you today some tips about online parties. I'm getting ready to close out nine from last week, the most I've ever had, and the way I got that many was that I called past hosts, but I also called customers that love our products and just have never wanted to have a party in their home. I explained what the process was and how easy it would be for them. Once they agreed, I set up a Facebook party event page for them. And then I made sure that I post, uh, you know, images and information before the party, during the party, and after the party, including encouraging bookings and uh, new consultant signups. Another thing to consider is a battle of the hostesses. If you're doing a Facebook event page and you've got several people doing the online parties, you can do one Facebook event page and encourage all of your hostesses to follow that page, invite their friends to that page, and then once the party starts and you start giving shout outs to people that are ordering on this person's party and then this person's party, it gets a little competition going and creates some excitement. Um, among customers and hostesses alike. So I hope this helps and I look forward to the next TS online party.